It's often the little things that influence our approach to life. Things that might appear unimportant, but which can still turn life into an adventure. The question is whether we allow this to happen. The search to find my limits and my tireless quest for adventure have brought me this far. My name is Stefan. I'm a Parascout in the Swiss Armed Forces. It all began at this fair screening three years ago. When I look around, I see a motivated young man with hopefully a goal, to make the first step to make the wrong move. Der Fallschirmaufklärer braucht eine rasche Auffassungsgabe. Er ist Einzelkämpfer, aber auch Teamplayer. Sie müssen in der Natur können überleben und den grossen Herausforderungen in der Luft und am Boden standhalten. Meine Herren, heute, genau heute, müssen Sie alles geben. Weil der heutige Tag ist entscheidend auf dem Weg zum Fallschirmaufklärer. On screening day, both our motivation and our athletic ability are put to the test. Here, no one is spared. From the start, Sphere is responsible for carrying out a strict selection process for all the participants. Finally, the Air Force Medical Institute makes sure the candidates meet the psychological and physical fitness requirements. This is where I meet Patrick. Die höchsten Bäume findet man in der Nähe der kleinen Waldlichtung. We have no idea yet that our paths are about to cross regularly and that we will become very close friends. We made it and have taken an important step forward. Patrick and I are now preparing together for the challenges that lie ahead of us. We know very well that the only ones who succeed are those who meet the strict theoretical requirements and gain the parachuting expertise that is needed. This also means that in two years we must be in top form to successfully complete the military parascout course. Until then, we attend the Sphere parachuting courses where we are taught the basic skills needed for handling a parachute. Step by step, we are introduced to free fall and parachute flight. These courses also provide us with the opportunity to obtain our civilian parachuting license. The next challenge is recruit school, which can only be successfully completed if we are in top physical condition. Thus, we try to integrate daily training as naturally as possible into our everyday lives.
Goedemorgen. Morgen. The challenging drills during recruit school are geared to getting us as ready as possible for our duties as military Paris scouts. Neues Ziel, H3, 1200 Meter. In the advanced training courses, we develop our skills and learn everything we need to know about reconnaissance in the field, including how to defend ourselves if we come in contact with the enemy. As Paris scouts in the Swiss Armed Forces, we collect vital information for operational command. We can be deployed independently in the theatre of operations for up to 10 days and fulfil our mission under the most difficult conditions. Als wir sind hier von Norden her gekommen, jetzt schlage ich vor, überqueren wir den Fluss an dieser Stelle. I am proud that I have successfully completed my training to become a certified Paris Scout and that I'm now able to use the skills I have acquired during operations. Victor 65 holding short runway 26, ready for departure. Victor 635, 270 degrees, 8 knots, runway 26 right, clear for takeoff. Being a Paris Scout does not mean we can ever fall or fail, but it means that if we do, we get back up again and keep on fighting. Three minutes. Being a Paris Scout is not a job. It's an attitude to life that is a deliberate decision you take, a decision that will change your life. Scouts being better when it counts.